Those are direct ships destroying that planet. We must help that commando. Agreed, Clank. We got to help him. Are you serious? That's it. I am out of here. Captain Quark is going to be sorry he messed with me. This is not about Captain Quark anymore. There's innocent life who's lost. Yeah? Well, I'm done with this stupid hero stuff. I got my own agenda now. Ratchet, this is not like you. What do you know about me? You've spent this whole time looking for Quark. You don't know anything about me. I know that you will do the right thing. Well, right now the thing I want to do is find Quark. How do you start this stupid thing? Have you forgotten? You need a robotic ignition system. I will start the ship if you agree to help that commando. Yeah, he's the only one who can help us at to find out what Drek's up to. So, blackmail is it? Fine. Just shut up and start the ship. Well, he sometimes gets me. After we found Cork at the race, until well, it was a trap to defeat that monster. <laughs> no, Clank, I'm not mad at you or somebody else. Trust me, don't mind Mirage, he's just in the bad mood, so I agree with you to help. Back so soon? Oh, you're talking to me. I'm not in the habit of talking to myself, you buffoon. Did you get rid of them? Yes. No. Well, I, I had this plan, and I thought... You thought? You thought? I do the thinking around here, you slug brain idiot. I simply needed you to eliminate those two nuisances before they could cause any real trouble. But I wanted to... Do you still want to be the highly paid spokesman for my planet? Yeah. Then the next time I send you to do a job, I want results! Now get out of my sight! Add attention, you deserting maggot! The next time you soldiers try to go AWOL, I'll shoot you myself! Look, I just wanna zip it, worm! You see those bombers? If you don't get to the turrets and knock those ships out of the sky, this whole planet's gonna be rubble! Meet me at the city entrance! He needs our help. Yeah? Why don't you go help him? Into another trap? Well, go on. Go fight some evil. At least I'm not a coward. <laughs> Whatever. As soon as I find Quark, I'm selling you for scrap. Ratchet! That's not nice to claim! Do you have to do this every time because you were in a such an abandonment? So can you please stop and let's help? Halt! Who are you? What are you doing? We are on a mission to save the galaxy. Speak for yourself and put your hands down. You look ridiculous. Actually, I don't care who you are. I've got to get the heck out of here. I joined the army to get money to go to college. I never knew I'd end up in a war. Go figure. This is a noble cause, sir. Noble my hiney. I just want to get home to my family. Here. I pulled this off a busted robot. Give me some bolts for a bus fare and it's yours. Thanks a bunch. Good luck saving the galaxy or whatever. Greetings, Supreme Executive Chairman Dreg. As you can see, we're about to test our newest automated pilot's helmet. This helmet allows pilots to control our latest high-tech fighters using only their thoughts. Please enjoy the demonstration. We still have a, a few minor adjustments to make. Oh, if they ever get the kinks worked out of that thing, I have got to get me one of those. If they are working for Chairman Drek, they may know where he is. Is that all you can think about, Drek this and Drek that? I got my own problems. If you cannot see the importance of this situation, you do have problems. Yeah? Well, if you're so smart, how come you fell for Quark's stupid trick? Ah, forget it. We both need to get to this planet and that's all that matters.
That's more like it. So he can stop arguing with Clint to find out about Dread.